Okay, thank you very much everybody. I, get, I only had two things to say. One is, it, it, of course, it does have a rich past. I was talking to, I guess, our, one of our most noted businessmen, farmers, and uh, philanthropists, uh, George Keala. He said that he met his wife, uh, who was at a drug, a drug store, and it was a fountain there, and it had much special memories that had him. I thought that was really, really something neat. However, uh, one of the things I did want to say is that everywhere I go up in the Upper Peninsula, Morgan Hill is now the company, or now the downtown people are talking about. Uh, I, I think I told you before in my little restaurant over there on weekends, two out of three of our clients are from north of Morgan Hill. People are starting to realize that this downtown is not only in the early stages of revitalization, it's actually well on its way. I, can, I do not know, I know of very few downtowns that are able to do this. Uh, and you can see what's happened in the last five years, or at least I can see what's happened in the last five years. And you can guess from looking at what's going on with the city, what's going on with the downtown development organization, what you see with the buildings that are under, under uh, design right now, what it's going to be like five years from now. And I was trying to think, what made the difference? Why did Morgan Hill make it the way it's making it? And these other small town, small downtowns not make it. And I think it's only a couple things. And it really gets down to people, and it gets down, frankly, to a combination of the city, uh, which is the, the, the elected officials as well as the uh, paid officials, and it gets down, more importantly than that, to these wonderful volunteer organizations, such as such as Downtown Morgan Hill, such as the, the organization that does the Fourth of July operation, uh, Morgan Hill, uh, uh, Morgan Hill Historical Society. All of them. I've never met a team of people that is so committed to downtown. And I was thinking a combination of those three events is what's causing us to be successful. And so I'm, I'm looking forward to having a multi-story building on this lot size uh, as fast as I can. I will never be as fast as they were able to do in the demo, I really think. <laughs> <laughs> I thought I would be able to see part of it. Uh, I was gone for two days. I come back this morning. I didn't get a chance to see it. Uh, so, uh, but it's going to be as fast as possible. And I hope we have a lot more memories in the new facility. Thank you.